Did you know that there's a camera within Adobe Spark Post on your phone? Well, stick around and I'll show you. What's happening everybody, Claudio here and welcome to my channel where I share tips, tools and tricks to help you share your story. Today I'm gonna to walk you through how you can use the camera within the Adobe Spark Post app on your phone. Right now it's currently only available on iOS so you can do this on your iPhone and on the iPad so hopefully soon it'll come to the Android. So without any further ado, let me walk you through on how to use the built-in camera. With Adobe Spark open here, what I'm going to do is tap on the green plus sign and normally i would just go and look for a photo in my library but here you can see in the menu i have the camera so i'm going to go ahead and tap it there and I'm going to take a picture of this lens that i have here so let's go ahead and tap there as you can see so now let's go ahead and let's take the photo let's do right about there got that nice little space right there for text on the side and use the photo and let's go ahead and choose the portrait size and click done. Now, the nice thing about this is you can make some adjustments to that photo. So tap on it and let's see. Let's adjust it that way. And I'm going to move my logo to the right. I'm going to edit this text here and say lens for my camera. Not very creative there, but that's cool. And what I'm going to do is take off that shape there. I don't want a shape behind this text, change the color, go with a dark color there, adjust the alignment and do something like that. What I can do now, since I've got the photo taken here is use the enhancement features built into Adobe Spark. So I tap on enhance there and I can adjust the contrast of that photo. If I want to, I can lower the saturation and maybe make some more adjustments here to highlights, bring down the brightness a bit, bring up the shadows or down, whatever you want. That's kind of close to where I want it to be. Maybe one last thing, maybe make it cooler there. Adjust the warmth and then click done. So I've pretty much taken the photo, edited, done some color correcting all within Adobe Spark Post. You could also use the camera if you already have a project created. So let's go ahead and do a demo there. So let me use, let's say this photo right here and tap on it. And basically what I do here is when I click or tap on the photo, I can go to edit and replace and there is the camera. So I can go ahead and take a picture of a project already created. This is really great if you already have kind of your design already created and all you want to do is swap out the photo and then just edit the text. It's a great way to speed up your process when you're creating content that you want to share. I hope you've learned something new today, something that you can use to share your story. If you have any comments or questions, please do leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't done so, and don't forget to click on the bell to be notified for future videos. Please do share this video with others. Thanks again for watching and as always, be good to one another. Peace. I'm out. Thank mm -hmm. you.